Hi everybody, this is Ashish from Technosport.net and today I will be talking about creating labels using Microsoft Office Word. The current version of Microsoft Office which I am using is 2010 but more or less you will find the same kind of features in other versions of Office. Now, labels are very important uh, for creating uh, putting into a, an envelope and if you want to print it at home instead of giving to a vendor which is sometimes very costly. Now, there are two options which I'll be talking about here. The first option is using the standard labels like in US you can find the every labels available which is of standard size. If you are in a different country it's possible that you will find labels of the similar standards. And the second option is to print it on a normal printer paper which most of us have. You have uh, the cost of uh, the cost of printing label goes down there because you don't use them standard label but then you need to take care of how you are going to uh, cut the uh, labels in proper format and all those stuff that additional things you will have to take care of that so let's start with it now you need to switch to the mailings tab here and select labels now here you have option now this is the envelope and labels window now you get a use return address. This is not required for uh, most of the labels unless you are just printing one and you need a return address at the end. Second is use the full page on the same label. So it's like if you want to use the complete page and have uh, the page utilized for all the labels you can go for that. But if you have requirement of only four or five labels then you can select single label. But this option depends on what is the type of label you use. So the best thing is we need to go to the options. Now here you have option for printer information, label information, the product number. Now I'll select a manual paper feed in case you are trying to do it for the first time. The reason is if you go for a automatic select it keeps on printing so that's what I don't want to do. So let's select manual paper feed and now you have a lot of label vendors that Microsoft supports depending on your country you will find it I am selecting here every US letter and maybe a particular product 5160 is one of the common product which is also called as easy 5260 we sort of have easy peel address labels uh, which generally it's like comes out like a sticker now if you are using the every standard labels you don't have to worry about the size and height and width. You just need to put it in the printer uh, printer tray properly. But if you're using going to use the normal printer, the A4 size or A5 size, whatever you have, you need two things: uh, the page size. You need to measure your page size and the height of the label that you need to print. Depending on that, it will print the labels accordingly on that paper. So make sure that this height and this width is the right for you depending on how long the addresses you have in case you want a bigger label select 5261 or 5262 it just increases the height so you can fill it all the address you can even select the shopping labels it's even bigger labels over here so let's select the 5260 the standard format and say okay and i'll use the full page of the same label i do not want to use the return address field so Let's forget about that and given that I will go now here if you select print it will directly go to the printer instead what we will do is we will select new document what this will do it will open in a new document and you will have all the labels available there where you can type down the address and the name field so just select new document now if you see here you get a proper boundaries of all the labels and you know the size and you can print it and just like I can type my name over here and my address is right here let's say Abra India and now if I want the second I will print out here so the whole page can be occupied by this the second thing now you can do is if you want to make your uh, labels a bit colorful select the table tools and here you can select a different combination let's say I'll select uh, pink so now this is the pink background which has come with the label if I want I'll select blue 
blue goes well with my son's birthday I can select blue or whatever format so this way you can even add colors to your printer or get the default one with the plain simple old type labels whatever you want to do and then once you are done all you need to do is say control P and I'll just print it to my I'm not printing to my actual printer but I'm printing it to a Snagit printer which will just give me an image of what I print so if I print it here this is what I've got uh, if I just zoom it a bit so this is what it looks like so if I fill in all the address all the address will come like you can see the address of mine comes here I'll just move it now when you print this printer and when you print this label you need to cut it according to the uh, boundaries and you have to very well take care of that so you know your printer when you paste it or you know, label the when you paste it on your envelope it looks good so this is about how you create a label using microsoft office word i hope you have liked the tutorial and if you have any comments do feel free, free to put in the comment below and ask us whatever doubts you have thanks for watching